everyone, my name is Sara and this is a short video about how important it is to warm up before we start a lesson. It's a great way to engage with students and make them feel more comfortable. So, usually it's a great idea to first of all ask children how they are feeling. For example, are you happy today? <gasps> no. So are you angry? <gasps> wow. Mm. Show me your angry face. Mm. And get children to act a bit silly and start feeling more comfortable with us. Another way is to also ask children about the things that they like doing or if you already know them, ask them about what they have been doing today. For example, hmm, do you like dancing? Wow, fantastic, me too. I love dancing. Or, hmm, do you like cats or dogs? Hmm. And ask them some questions to get them involved. Another great way to break the ice, especially with young students, is to introduce our favourite toy and ask them to tell us a bit about their favourite toy. You will find that children love showing us their toys. And again, it's a great way to get them feeling at home. Another way is to have small games to introduce the topic and the theme that the lesson is going to be about. For example, if the lesson is going to be about rooms, especially the bathroom, and the things that we can see in the bathroom, I like playing a guessing game. So, I can show them, hmm, everybody look, what is it? Hmm, what is it? A, a towel, well done, fantastic, a towel, wow, very good. And, hmm, look, what is it? A brush, hmm, can I brush my hair with it? No. I brush my teeth with it. Fantastic. So what is it? A toothbrush. Well done. And that way we introduce the topic and get them thinking about it. Also, if we can act a little bit silly, usually kids will really have a laugh and they will feel a bit less shy when it's their turn to talk. And there are many games we can use, especially with students that we already know or if we're going to introduce lessons that it's not that easy to have guessing games about. We can always play I Spy With My Little Eye. It might be a good idea to prepare a background with things like a toy car, a balloon, a flower, anything you like to get them to play. Another great game is, as children love drawing, is to use the whiteboard and get them to draw something, describe it to the class and all of us close our eyes and try to guess what the drawing is. Children will really find that fun and that way they will all get engaged and they will be really, really excited to then start the lesson. So I hope that has been helpful for you and don't forget, be unique, have your own style and children will absolutely love you. Best of luck. Thank you.